Horses are trading to the post for the fourth race. Race four, Phillies and Mares Condition Pacers, racing one mile. Purse of $3,750. Number one is quite a strike. Home of the Indian Springs Farms of Johnstown, Ohio, James Hess, the driver. Number two, listen for Cam, owned by a teenage rider of Thornville, Ohio, with Dave Hawk. Number three, our Calico, owned by Dina Taylor of Washington Courthouse, Bob Harper drives. Four is Fox Valley Julie, owned by Mr. Brett Boyd of Hillsdale, Michigan, Bob Harmon driving. The five, Lady Pharmacist, owned by the Newcastle a Stable of Springfield, Ohio, the driver Dave Miller. Number six, Shoot and Scooch, of a Conklin of Sugar Falls, and a dupe of Newark, Ohio, Tom D. Hall, driving. Seven, Sand My Visit, on by Fred and Pete Polk of Zanesville, Ohio, Paul Longishik is in the bike. And from post eight, Why Not Molly, on by George Kincaid of Marion, Ohio, Dave Repine, in the sulky. One play show, perfecta, trifecta, superfecta wagering, fourth race trophy by Jerome T. Osborne. Pacing Phillies and Mares, field of eight, lining up, moving in. The gate swings into the stretch for the start. Here they come. Off and pacing mid track, Lady Pharmacist hustled right out for the lead. Our Calico right there between horses, but to the inside, listen for Cam using the inside to her advantage. And listen for Cam up to take the lead. Our Calico dropping in alertly in second now. Lady Pharmacist settles in third. To the inside, fourth is Fox Valley Jolie. Followed in five by Shoot and Scoot. Then comes quite a strike. The uh, trailers, why not Molly? And send my visit. Coming to the first quarter mile marker, 29 seconds flat, and Miller is out and moving quickly. Lady Pharmacist from third is now on the front, and Lady Pharmacist easily clearing for the lead. Listen for Cam of the inside, racing in second. At the rail and racing in third is our Calico. Inside fourth is Fox Valley Jolie. Next in five, shoot and scoot. A gap of two lines, sixth, quite a strike. Coming to the outside in seventh, why not Molly and Sand My Visit last in eighth. Coming to the half, and it's Lady Pharmacist leading the way a length and a half. Listen for Cam of the inside. Now, first up, here comes Shoot and Scoot. Big move from that one. Half was 59 and four. Around the first turn to the back stretch they go, and it's Lady Pharmacist and Dave Miller leading a length right at his wheel. Shoot and Scoot with Tom D. Hall racing in second. Hawk with Listen for Cam sitting behind the leader, tracking along in third. And here comes our Calico, second over to the outside and fourth. Fox Valley Jolie on the inside, races in five, and San My Visit is on the move from the back of the pack. Three quarters and one, 29 and two. To the far turn, it's Lady Pharmacist. Two wide is Shootin' Scoot. Up on the outside, three wide, our Calico. And down at the rail, listen for Cam, waiting for racing room. Last center eighth of a mile ago. And down the stretch they come, Lady Pharmacist. Here comes Listen for Cam, out of the pocket with a quick burst to speed. Coming to the wire, it's Lady Pharmacist. Listen for Cam, but it's Lady Pharmacist at the wire. Lady Pharmacist, the winner. Listen for Cam, second. Fox Valley Jolie up for third. The mile one, 58 and three. Stepping trackside to the winner's circle, winner of the fourth race. Number five, Lady Pharmacist. Lady Pharmacist, three-year-old daughter of Precious Bunny out of Amelo Bell by No Nukes. Home right home by the Newcastle Stable of Springfield, Ohio. Doug Lock, the trainer, Dave Miller. The winning driver, his 11th win this week at Delaware. For Lady Pharmacist, her fifth of her career, pacing the mile 158, three fifths. The fourth race trophy by Jerome T. Osborne and trackside to make the trophy presentation, Mr. and Mrs. Osborne. Here's our prices for the fourth race.